Dante DiVincenzo, uh, Ty Jerome, they're him. They're them. They're them, man. The bench is getting better each and every single game. Just like Steve Kerr said, this team is getting better each and every single game. And they would not have won a game like this earlier in the season. Like, the young guys are legit getting better and, better and the bench is getting better, man. It's crazy. It's crazy. That was insane. Did I expect them to win? I actually didn't expect them to win because they're at home. And they're 15-2 and two at home now. And 3-16 and 16 on the road, which is in, in crazy insane. The best home record and the worst road record. They definitely got to change the road, man. They got to change. They got to get better on the road. Seriously. Because they would have the best home, best record in the NBA easily if they were at least 500 on the road. If they were at least 500 on the road, they have the best record in the NBA. Easily. Easily, man. It's crazy. And, yeah, shout out to, obviously, Ty Jerome. Incredible tonight. Incredible game. Second half, obviously. Uh, 17. <laughs> Took over the third and the fourth quarter. Literally... So many floaters using Wiseman in the pick and roll, making Wiseman, he sh make him, making Wiseman screen and uh, making Wiseman use his body, man. It's like, just like he's just such a great pure point guard. Like he and just the confidence is through the roof, it's through the roof, man. And seeing him out there pull up threes, uh, and one uh, floaters over Colin Sexton, man, that was that was insane. It was insane. And then Dante DiVincenzo. He didn't score last night, obviously, off the back-to-back. -back. They played yesterday, but him scoring after not scoring yesterday, he knew he had to score tonight, gave him 19 tonight, and obviously he hit big shots throughout the whole game. Big shots throughout the whole game from Dante, man. Obviously, give him a six-point lead, and then two to three threes in the first. He was great. Obviously, added four rebounds and two assists. Just a great game from him. He is one of the best pickups of the offseason. Seriously. He is easily one of the best pickups of the offseason. And MP plays defense as well. If you didn't know that. Um, <clears throat> obviously a super inefficient game from Jordan Poole. 31% uh, from the field. But he had 27. But he got to the free throw line. The team got to the free throw line tonight. That is back to back games now. They've gotten to the free throw line. And they've actually out shot teams from the free throw line. And that's great, man. They're getting better. As a team, they're getting better without Steph Curry and Andrew Wiggins out there. Who? Andrew Wiggins is doubtful to come back on Friday, but there's a chance he can come back on Friday, which is great, which is absolutely great. And I can't wait for that. I cannot wait for that. Obviously, shout out to um, shout out to Draymond. Fighting through these many minimal injuries, but he's fighting through them. Came out there and played defensive player of the year defense in the fourth quarter. Two clutch blocks in the fourth. Uh, also, I want to shout out to him yesterday for, for that uh, high IQ foul on Miles Plumley. That was high IQ. Don't forget about that. That was insane. But Draymond today was just insane defensively in that fourth quarter. Yeah, just like I said, DPOY level play in that fourth quarter by him. Like, just amazing stuff by him. And then also... He hit one of the biggest shots of the game when they were down 10. It was looking like they were done, and then he hits a three. And then he gives a, hits a three to uh give them the lead. Like, he is just a four-time champion and a veteran, an all-star, defensive player of the year. He showed that all tonight. He showed that tonight. That's who Draymond Green is. That's who he is, man. Got to love Draymond for that. Um, Wiseman gave great minutes tonight. Let's not forget about that. Uh, he needs a longer leash, though. He needs a longer leash, obviously. He he had himself four points and four rebounds, and I don't even know how many minutes he played, but it felt like he played, like, ten. Not even ten. He probably played nine or eight minutes tonight. I felt like he should have played more. I don't... I uh, uh, Looney hasn't been playing the best, so I felt like Wiseman could have played more tonight. I, I definitely felt like that. But, hey... Hey, I, Kerr has been doing a great job coaching, so I'm not going to question him. I'm not going to question him, even though I did question this. I think he, I thought Wiseman should have played more tonight. Ooh, who else should I talk about? Uh, Well, we know about Kuminga. Kuminga, well, <laughs> Kuminga, he's him. He's him, too. He's one of those guys. He's him. Defensively and offensively, man, he just knows how to get to the rim. 
he had one of the plays where they were down 10 and get, down 12 and he gets down to the rim easily and one just playing great defense out there on Laurie Markin and all up in his space just like he said he learned he's learned from Iguodala and Draymond Green you know he doesn't want to get scored on anymore he takes it personally on the defensive end and he's just getting better and you can see it his confidence he, the way he holds himself it's just like I'm like bro he is getting better he is a playoff player he is. He is, man. He is, for real. Dude, man, this team, this is what I, this is the literally, like, at, they're at home, but this is the best case scenario so far. 3-0 uh, and all at, on the homestand, 18-18 and 18 now, 500. Ty Drum looking like he about to get that 15th spot <laughs> over Anthony Lamb, obviously. But yeah, yeah, he's getting that 15th spot. He's got to. The way he performed these last few, he's performed these last few games for sure, and the entirety of the season since we first started them, when we're they were on that five game losing streak. So, yeah, that's uh, but that's it. Just a great win overall, man. Like a team win. Everyone deserved flowers for this win. Great game, and got the t Trailblazers Friday. GP 2s return. I don't know if he's going to play. He's still got that core injury. But remember, like the video. Subscribe to the channel. Check out the other videos on my channel. Share the video. Turn on notifications. Do all of that right now. Right now. Do it. But yeah. I'll see you guys later. Friday. Peace out.